Welcome back to the vlog, you guys. You guys, remember, if you want to see your comment up here, you have to comment, okay? So make sure you hit that like button and subscribe button. So let's get into the first comment. It comes from Marvin and Josh. Y'all was talking about, you know, House Party is one of your favorite movies and what your love language is. Let me know, is it Marvin or Josh or both of y'all that's writing on these comments? Kelly was talking about she didn't know that you get a discount on gas from Kroger. Yeah, girl. Um, Queen Love reminded me how funny my face looked on that roller coaster, y'all. I'm terrified of heights, okay? Um, this person told me that the AARP video helped them out. I'm so glad that it did. Uh, Melissa said, great video. Love them. She's always watching the videos. Thanks, Melissa, girl, for the constant love. Miss Jones was telling me, girl, I don't even know about porosity and all them charts. That's good because it's very confusing. And the Peridot also let me know that she really liked my skin and she didn't know I was self-conscious about it. Yeah, girl, I'm self-conscious. And Megan told me that putting that video out reminded her to give her some grace. And y'all, it was just so sweet. I love these comments. Another great workout, y'all. I have about 20 minutes before I need to sign into the computer. So I'm gonna go in, shower, and then I'll see y'all later. I'm about to make my breakfast smoothie. So we've got, okay, we got some sea moss. We got some blueberries. We got some blackberries, some almond milk, some cinnamon, some frozen pineapple chunks, a banana. And I like to put my um, berries and like some white vinegar and a little bit of water, let them sit for a few minutes, try to clean them before I put it in. Here is my smoothie. Cheers. Mm. It's good. I feel healthier already. Good morning, happy Thursday everybody. Rich and I just left the gym. I know, I know, I didn't bring y'all along with me for the ride because we was getting in. I don't know if you can see all the sweat on me, armpit sweat, just sweaty. Um, but what I need to do today is take a shower. I need to do laundry. I need a pack because we're actually about to go see one of my really, really, really good friends for over 20 years now. Um, visit her, she lives in Georgia. So we're gonna take a little road trip. So yeah, I got a lot to do. I gotta wash my hair, gotta do my nails. I got, I got a lot to do. So that's what we got going on right now. Okay y'all, in the first vlog, I talked about going to this place right here and I can confirm we really like this laundry detergent. If you have a Buff City soap in your area, check out this one. Uh, this one is the fresh cotton uh, scent with baking soda. Anytime you empty one of your jars, you get a dollar off of your refill, so that's always nice. And if you like an extra little scent, they uh commando booster. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It kind of smells like a man a little bit, but like in a really good way. Y'all remember the Michael Jordan cologne? It kind of reminds me of that, but like it just it just smells good. So y'all try try the commando scent and the fresh cotton with the baking soda boosted. Yeah, my hair is a mess. I know I don't worry about it. It'll be fixed tomorrow. I have a tough decision because I'm about to do my nails and I don't know which nails I want to do. I need some help. Let me show y'all what my decision is gonna be between. So do we wanna do the bedazzle nails right here? Do we wanna go for like the marble nails? I don't know why it's not focusing, focus. Okay, the marble nails, or do we wanna do the classic nude? Let me know in the comments which ones I should do, cause I, I don't know which nails I wanna wear. <sighs> that up right here, I'll, I'll link everything. I got my gloves to put on to protect me from the rays, from the, from the uh, UV lamp, my nails, nail file, cuticle oil, my gel polish. Yeah, these are my before nails. Not too much going on here. 
I ended up deciding to go with the nude nails. I don't know why I've been going with nude nails lately. I've been favoring that. But anyway, I have plenty of other nails so I can switch it up. Now y'all, these nails will last you over two weeks if you do it this way. What I do is I put the nail glue on my regular nail and I put it under the light for about six seconds just to semi-cure it. Then I take it out, put the nail glue on top of the fake nail and then apply that to my real nail and put it back under the light and I let that cure for one minute, y'all. I'm telling you, this is a game changer. These last, you don't have to pay no $70, $80 to get your nails done. You can do it at home. They're really inexpensive and it comes in a pack of five. So that basically makes it a $5 gel manicure because you get them, you know, there's five different packs. Oh my gosh, y'all, it is thundering and lightning outside. Please ignore this background. <laughs> But all I did was put on a um, cuticle oil on the bottom and the top gloss on top. And there we are. And like I said, it lasts over two weeks. Good morning. Happy Friday, you guys. Today is the day I get to go see my girlfriend and her family. Kelly, we are on the way, girl. Um, I just got through working out. I don't know if y'all can see the sweat, but it's there. And I need to wash my hair before we go because it's looking a little a little crazy. But I think I want to make like a separate video about that because y'all been asking me like for like a hair routine and a skincare routine. So I'm gonna try to film those uh, this week. Um, but yeah, it's it's really fun. Like when you cut your hair, you have to relearn your hair all over again because your curl pattern might change, your porosity might change, uh, especially like when you color it and stuff. So I'm still trying to figure out what works best for me. And that's the fun part because before I had I had a system down pack, but now it's like a little different. So I got to figure out what works for me and y'all get to see that journey. Okay, I know I said that I was going to take a shower and wash my hair, but we have to have a quick little intermission because I just got a notification from CVS, baby, and they give me a free five dollars and you know how I feel if it's free it's for me so I'm gonna go in here and get some like maybe like some water or, like some snacks for the road trip here we go y'all see that CVS app oh shoot drop my phone okay anyway like I was saying here we go five dollar flash sale redeemed by Saturday today's Friday so this you only have 24 hours to use it so I'm gonna go ahead and go get this right now. Okay, y'all, I was walking and look what I found right at the entrance. It's a slug. Y'all, when's the last time y'all seen a slug? Oh my gosh, hey friend. Okay, you be careful out here in these streets now, okay? All right, I'm going down this snack aisle trying to see. Ooh, ooh they got some Reese's Pieces. I'm trying to stay away from sugar. Y'all, sugar really ain't that good for you. And of course, I'm on the sugar aisle, the Twizzlers, Lemon Head, Mike and Ike's Hot Tamales, good and plenty. Y'all, let me know, like, what, what's your favorite type of, like, candy, movie theater candy, just candy to have in your candy jar at home. Let, let me know, because my ultimate favorite is Twizzlers. I'm a licorice fan, honey. I like Twizzlers. I like the, um, what they call, Rips. It's like little, Sour, it's kind of like sour punch straws, but they're like little squares and they come in red and green. Ooh, it's so good, so good. And I like Reese's Pieces. All right, look like we made a decision. We gonna roll with this $1.59 goldfish. I'm gonna get two of those, one for me, one for Rich. Oh, y'all, they got um Pop-Tarts on sale for $2. I like strawberry Pop-Tarts, but I just got me some. But Rich likes the cherry Pop-Tarts and he's running low on his, so I'm gonna probably just get that and that'll, that'll, uh, that'll end my five dollars, so we good. There we are. We only have to spend 17 cents. And don't forget to scan your Fetch rewards for your receipts. Twenty-five points for that receipt. Now I'm gonna hit the tap to play for the bonus. We're gonna see how many extra points we get. Seventy-five. Yes, sir. So that's a hundred points today, baby. That's really good. I know, right? Now I have twenty-four hours before I can do another bonus. But look, I got over twenty-one thousand points. And remember, on Fetch, you can exchange those points for gift cards, all that stuff. So we had got airline tickets with our last cash out. 
All right, our bags are packed and we're ready to go. Name that song. <laughs> have like a little weekend getaway. These are excellent. They fit so much and we've been using them for like two years. Very sturdy. All right, y'all, so we finally made it on the road. We're just driving. Be there soon. This is Jacksonville, Florida. We've had several standstill moments. We have four, over four hours left to drive. We, we are still driving. It says we will get there at 9.21 p.m. Today was a good day though. Morning, happy Saturday. We made it safely and we had a good night's rest. We got in like 9.20 p.m. Yeah. And me and Kelly talked for probably like another like 40, 45 minutes. Yeah. So we about to go downstairs, see what everybody talking about. Look at this cute bracelet that my friend's daughter made for me. That's so cute. Does it fit right? Yes, it fits perfect. Thank you. This, wait, wait. I adore oh. it. I'm to use some paper plates. I'll be using paper plates too. <laughs> Stop it. How did, I can never pronounce that name. What, Tarushibu or Charcuterie? Charcuterie? Char, char, <laughs> it's charcuterie. 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 Yeah. See, that's why I don't even say it. <laughs> All right, we are in Augusta, Georgia, you guys, and they're they're taking us to a farmers market. So we're walking right now up the street to the farmers market. Okay. Ooh, those plums look good. Mango look good too. Apricots, peaches are only 50 cents. Ooh, what are those? Are those cinnamon rolls too? They look like it. Are these what cinnamon these? rolls? Um, there is a strawberry, blueberry, and blueberry. Are they, they, they have like inside or what? It's on top. Okay. Peach mango. Peach mango. Let me see. Oh, that smells good. That's all good. Let me see your hands. Well, after I, we make everything hey. here it's with the exception of the African soap and the shea butter. We double, once we get the shea butter, we double yeah. filter it. Oh, yeah. How much? Then all of our round soap is loofah soaps. Ah. We cut the loofah and then move yeah. our soap Some around. loofah in the soap. Oh, wow. That's innovative. Yeah, that I've is. never seen that yeah. before. And believe me, coming out of the garage, coming out of yard work, right, using right. the loofah sponge on the yeah. body. It works on. Great experience. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Might end up getting some yeah. shea butter up here. Yeah. yeah, that would be our charcoal oatmeal mix. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Moisturize. So we just got some shea butter and body butter from this vendor. I'll leave the card info down below, but it smells so good. My hands feel super hydrated now. Y'all, get you some friends that will pull out the red carpet for you, okay? Like Y'all, they were not playing. We had beef ribs, we had salmon. Like, y'all, they threw down. Look how tender and juicy. Stop playing with them, okay? Do not play with them. Like, y'all, we are so appreciative. Like, me and Kelly have been friends. We finally decided what the number was. We have been friends for 27 years, okay? Like, some of y'all ain't even had, like, friends that long like y'all i am so blessed to have this woman in my life and of course in richard's life now because now she's his friend her husband is our friend like their children are shoot those are our nieces and nephews okay <laughs> but yes like the food was bomb we got potatoes we got what now how do you pronounce this what is it room a lot room a lot okay mm -hmm. and then we got garlic, uh, sun dried tomato pasta. pasta. Here comes Jay with the yes. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. My mouth is watering. So delicious looking. We got salad. <laughs> and then we got potatoes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Besides the excellent food, one of the highlights of the night was learning about Zelda. Y'all, now I am invested in this video game. Is he hard to beat? Yes, he's very hard to beat. Man. Oh gosh, he sounds scary. 
He's scary. I have all your powers. He's pretty scary. Have you seen him already? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -oh. And you beat him already? No. No. <laughs> so your opponents will have weapons that you fight, and if you beat them, you get the weapon. Mm. Oh, so you okay. gotta beat your opponent. Yeah. If they'll have them like on the ground, kind of. Uh huh. And so, like the Bokoblins I was talking about, they they the bad guys, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so like they just I don't like them. Mm -hmm. They sound mm -hmm. nasty. Bokoblins. <laughs> yeah. And he has this Bokoblin hood that does it scare I, him away? No. Mm -mm. It actually makes them friends. Oh, so you can befriend them. Because they think you're one of them. Yeah. They're kind of, kind of disguising the oh, yeah. Okay, okay. So you can sneak around them that way then, too. Yeah. Oh, okay. I hate like when he wears it. I hate the way it Because it, it's ugly, huh? Mm -hmm. mm. But coffins are ugly. They it sound even, it. It doesn't even look like a book coffin. Happy Sunday, y'all. We are at one of the busiest gas stations I've ever seen in my life. This place is called um, Bucky's. Never been here. And I think we're gonna try to go inside, maybe show y'all what it looks like, cause I'm interested to see because it is packed. We're in, is this Daytona? Yeah. Daytona, Florida. This is like a whole store. Oh my gosh. Y'all, they got like three burritos and tacos, jerky. Y'all, they have this all different kinds of jerky in here. I don't want to film and like get too many people faces in the video but it is a lot. Oh my gosh it is huge in here. Got coffee mugs, tumblers, cinnamon roll, cookies. Okay. Okay. Bucky's is an experience for sure. Hey, good afternoon. Happy Monday, y'all. Oh my gosh, it felt so good to see my friend, y'all. Like, we've been friends. We were talking, like, we had lots of laughs, lots of conversation. And we were talking, we we're like, yo, how long have we been friends? And we did our math. It's been 27 years that we've been friends. That is a long time, like almost three decades, y'all. Like, when you find genuine people in your life, like, that give the same energy that you give, they pour into you just like you pour into them, you keep them people around and you hold them tight. So, Kelly, I love you, girl. You're my sister. You are. You already know she be watching she be watching these y'all so I'm, I'm talking to her just one-on-one -on -one, but y'all y'all kind of in the conversation right now but you know you already know what it is like I love you so thank you for having us we had so much fun now we got back home yesterday and I'm not gonna lie to y'all we really didn't do too much except for put our clothes down and get in the bed so we took a really long extended nap so that's all that happened yesterday after we got back because it was like a seven hour drive. Uh, so today, Richard and I have a date night. I can't wait. Uh, we have a movie at seven. So we're gonna probably leave like around six so we can get some food to sneak in because you know how we do. And also, I got another CVS, y'all. CVS keep keep getting getting me these uh five dollar coupons and you know I'm all look if it's free it's for me. There we go five dollars off it expires. One day left. I'm actually running low on my deodorant and there's a coupon for deodorant and that reminds me y'all know I like to save y'all some money. So the deodorant I use is the Secret um, aluminum free cotton scent smell and that is a Unilever brand and Unilever is under P and G so PG good every day like if you go on the website they'll send you coupons and they'll send you free stuff so they recently sent me this three dollar off um, Downy Unstoppables coupon right here three dollars off and they gave me a free sample like literally just sign up I'll put that in the description box. You just sign up on PNG Good every day. They send you coupons, they send you free samples, 
it's free, you know, if it's free, it's for me. Y'all, we in Moe's because we hungry and we gonna have this in the movie theater. Two adobo chicken bowls, thank you. Please and thank you. We are on a date. On a date, y'all, on a date. To go to movie night. Oh. Let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> I had to get in the sun real quick so y'all could catch, catch the look, you know. Um, also, we have no idea what we're going to see. If y'all have a Regal movie theater close to you, Regal does do a mystery movie Mondays. So you get to see a movie that hasn't premiered yet. So I'm low key, high key, low key, high key hoping it's Indiana Jones because I really want to see that movie and I don't want to pay full price for it. So I'll let you know once we get in the movie theater and the show start playing what it ended up being. Monday mystery. I have no idea what we're seeing. Let's go do it, y'all. Let's see. Let's find out. And this 12 track album is inspired by the Fee Gees and an overall 70s sound. Okay, it was not Indiana Jones. Definitely not. Definitely not. But right. it was actually funny. It was a, it was a good <laughs> movie. Put this in trash. Yeah. Not something that we would have even gone to see at all. Yeah, but. it was called Theater Camp. It comes yeah. out July 14th, I think is what it yeah. said. Y'all, it it's funny. funny. It's, it's funny. funny. So yeah. be on the lookout for that. <laughs> <laughs> now we gotta get on home. Yeah. Get in the bed. Get some rest. Get some rest. <laughs> yeah, Richard so done dragged me out to Universal Studios again. Get on that ride again, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> no, we are absolutely not getting on that ride. <laughs> I know y'all are probably like, y'all are always at Universal Studios. If you didn't know, we are Universal Studios uh, annual pass members. And it just makes sense, y'all. Like a one day pass is like 120 bucks. An annual pass is like 230 bucks. So just pay the extra 100 bucks and then you can go anytime you want for 15 months. Like we actually got 15 months instead of 12 months. So even if you don't live in Florida, just keep that in mind if you come to Florida a few times a year like once you go that first time it already pays for itself so just yeah so we're gonna go see and what we see what we can do up in here in the parks today Universal I'm already sweating we're not even in the park yet I haven't even done anything baby yeah that's sun <laughs> that's Florida sun <laughs> it's not even I don't even think it's officially summer yet I think the official first day of summer is like July something Line, don't give me the line but i'm pretty sure y'all let me know when is the first official day of summer we are trying out a new spot we rarely eat at the parks but they have this place called central park crate yeah and guess what we got to eat for free because yeah. we had some universal gift cards that yeah. universal gave to us so we're gonna try them out and show y'all how they taste the orders are made to order so it was so fun to watch them make them through the window thank you oh my gosh this looks so good wow thank you so much enjoy thank guys you. we'll do we'll do right. Ooh, that looks good oh, yeah. babe I don't... just bite it can't see you down there with your hat how is it it's good it's, it's real good, good. yeah Okay. Sweet and savory. All right. Good. The brisket right there, y'all. What is it? Coleslaw with a little piece of brisket on it. Yeah. Right okay. there. I have more down there, but we like. Go ahead. All right. I'm going to just dig in. Dig in, girl. Mm. Oh, it's good. Mm -hmm. Really nice presentation, too. You got your strawberries on there. What's mm -hmm. that? Your uh, blueberries? Yeah. Oh, and I had them substitute because this is actually supposed to be hazelnut strawberry, but I don't I don't do nuts. So I asked if I could substitute blueberries and they did. Free of charge. Nice. Minute black. <laughs> have to go whoop whoop Rich's butt real quick. Yeah, okay. I am. Okay, I'm, I've tuned. been old for like three. The past three times we came, I done lost, so I got a step it up. 20 minute wait. We normally do the five and 10 minute wait, but I guess we could do the 20 minute yeah. wait. It said 20, y'all. It was a walk on. It was literally like as soon as we walked through here, we already about to get on. So, so they was lying on that thing. I think to keep people away from getting on here, but this is one of our favorite rides. So we about to get up on here. Like I said, I'm about to whoop Richard's butt real quick. And I'll show y'all the score at the end. Oh my gosh, they be cheating! 1.30 to 3.04. I told you. 
good job. You was cheating, bro. You was cheating. Oh, oh my God, cheater. So they have a new restaurant called the Minion Cafe. Let me know if y'all want me to like do a video or me and Rich to do a video with us trying some food up in there because it's brand new. It just opened. And we have come to the end of the vlog, everybody. Thank y'all so much for watching these vlogs. Like I would not be making these vlogs without y'all. So the fact that y'all keep coming and watching these videos, like it just, keeps me going wanting to make more videos we got a very special vlog coming up soon so be on the lookout for that and also I just want to like tell y'all like this vlog was really like it was close to my heart like when you haven't seen like your friends in a long time or even your family members in a long time and you get to see them like it really just makes a difference so again Kelly girl thank you for having us like you do not know how much that was so needed like i know me and you were talking about it but it was so needed just to be around like a true genuine friend that i call my sister i love you and for everybody out there i just hope that you guys have someone special in your life whether it's a family member or a family member that you know happens to come from a different mother like i hope that you guys have found you know your person or persons that you can pick up the phone and you know that they will answer and you know just be there to pray for you be there to help provide you know peace and guidance and you know just ask for advice or give you know sound advice so I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and we enjoyed the vlog as well. And we'll, we'll see y'all in the next one, all right? Until next time, everybody. Peace.